Good evening. Since the 19th century, Barnardo's has been reaching out to the children that the rest of society has forgotten. And it's work like this which will mean that it is easier to be able to reach out and find those young people who desperately need our help. We don't do the easy stuff in society. We work with the most vulnerable children, those that sometimes have no hope in their lives. They have no care, no attention. And Bernardo steps up, giving people the chance to cope and recover. Bernardo's is a charity that has gone from strength to strength, and you are a key partner for government. I'm very grateful for all the work that you have done with the Home Office and that you continue to do, providing the independent child trafficking advocate service, for example, hosting the National FGM Centre, and establishing and leading the Centre for Expertise on Child Sexual Abuse. Thank you for all the work that you do with us. Even though, you know, when Bernardo's was first set up, the world was a very different place, but Bernardo's imperative to look after vulnerable children is still absolutely at the forefront of their agenda. So it's an amazing charity and um, I feel very privileged to be part of it. With the right support, these children and young people can overcome adversity and have a positive future. As we adapt to an ever-changing world, we must ensure that our response, whether it is the police, the local authorities, social workers, central government or other agencies, is to believe in children, to listen to their voice, so that we understand the full picture of what's going on in their lives and are much better able to protect them. Thank you. I've supported Bernardo's probably all my life since we had the little uh, box that we put the coins in, the little house. But actually since uh, taking the role of Nathan in Coronation Street, I've realised much more closely about the, the immense work they do across the country. It's uh, they're a very powerful cause for good. Our society is changing and children are facing new risks by the day. And those of us responsible for keeping children safe need to be ahead of the curve. And we need to do everything in our power to work together to make that happen. What's good about Bernardus, they work with children but young people as well and they're always brilliant at moving with the times. I don't know what we do without Bernardos. I think hearing from people that have been helped by Bernardos always makes you think actually it is something simple that we can do, except it's never simple is it, because to keep engaged in that process is quite hard. So that's why I'm amazed at the work Bernardo does and they continue to do the work that is all of our responsibility, that's the government's responsibility and I hope everyone recognises that they're just doing something that is all of our responsibility and so we need to help them do it. We have a duty to do it. When I was working for Bernardo's uh, some uh, seven years ago, uh, I remember us uh, talking to uh, a group of young people who had uh, suffered from exploitation. And one of them said a line that will, will stick with me for the rest of my life. They said, we are not hard to reach. We're always told that we're the ones who are hard to reach, hard to find. The exploiters have found us. The exploiters have reached us. Why can't other people do the same? So my message to you all today is that I want to listen to what you have to say. I want you to share your knowledge and your experience with me and my team and more widely with government so that together we can do much more to make sure that children have happy childhoods. People don't come and work for any charity, let alone Bernardo's, for fame or fortune. They come for the cause. It's the cause that drives that passion. It's that cause that makes us do the stuff that we probably wouldn't be able to do in any other profession, you know, in terms of going the extra mile. And the thousands of people that make that happen, the staff and the volunteers of Bernardo's, whom I, you know, absolute delight, pleasure and pride goes out to, they're the ones that make it happen. But we can't do it alone. We need your support. We need your promotion of the work. And if there's anything any of you have heard tonight that has touched you, tell your friends, tell your family. If you agree with the work that Bernardo's is doing and others like us, tell the world about it. We can actually create a better world for the most vulnerable children. We can create a better country and society. But we need your help. I look forward to it. Thank you for everybody for your time tonight.